Patients at the King George Medical University in Lucknow were wheeled out on the road as tremors were felt. Doctors were performing surgeries when everything around them started shaking and falling, including monitors and instruments. They still managed to somehow finish the surgery and then wheel patients out. Headlines today is Amir Haq now joins me with the latest. Amir, describe to us scenes across Lucknow. Well, Gaurav, uh, you know, people, uh, especially the ones who are living in high-rise buildings and apartments, are still very, very scared. You know, I I know of people who haven't gone inside their homes. They they just managed to uh, gather enough courage to go and lock their homes. And uh, people are sitting in parks outside, uh, you know, in open spaces uh, still because uh, they, they, they have been told that there could be more aftershocks. So even, uh, you know, almost six uh, six, six and a half hours after the initial earthquake uh, was felt, uh, people are still very, very scared. We also spoke to, you know, people in hospitals, in cinema halls, in, uh, uh, in, in various public places like malls. You know, these were the people uh, who were uh, suddenly caught unaware. They didn't know how uh, to, you know, if they were there on, uh, uh, on higher stories. They, they, there was nobody to lead them uh, to staircases uh, because in most of uh, these cases, staircases are concealed. So they were really scared and such people, uh, you know, I, we in fact spoke to some of those people who came out of cinema halls. We asked them whether you would want to go back and watch the movie that you've still left unfinished. They said, we're not going back. So, you know, those images of 2001 earthquake are still very, very fresh in the memory of people. And so many other pictures that they've seen from Pakistan, from Afghanistan, also recently from Kashmir. Therefore, most of these people are very scared. Although uh, they are following it up on the media, on the social media, uh, uh, people are also, uh, you know, discussing on how uh, uh, after uh, shocks uh, uh, are to be treated, uh, they should be out on open spaces. If they are traveling, they should stay inside their cars or whichever vehicle they are into, should stay away from trees and uh, uh, electric poles. Uh, but, uh, you know, this will take some time to settle down. Uh, also, uh, news emanating from Nepal, since uh, it is also uh, coming in scratches, uh, you know, uh, people have still not been able to understand uh, the overall magnitude of this earthquake. Uh, but really, you know, talking about Lucknow, because it is yes. almost, uh, as the crow flies, about five to 600 kilometers from the epicenter, uh, the, uh, the, the, uh, the tremors were very palpable, and therefore people still very, very shocked, almost seven hours after the earthquake. You're on your way to Nepal as you travel across the land route. Is there fear in these parts as you travel? Uh, you know, we got a report from Gorakhpur that seemed to indicate that a team from North Bihar had to be diverted to Gorakhpur given the devastation and the fear there. Well, yes, uh, Gaurav, we are on way to uh, uh, the Sonoli uh, border uh, near Gorakhpur. Uh, although there is not much of devastation that is seen in this part of eastern UP, but yes, we understand uh, as far as reports coming in from uh, North uh, Bihar, uh, you know, uh, there has been considerable devastation there. Uh, so, but we expect more of it uh, the other side of the border uh, towards Nepal. Uh, well, people here, as I told you, in Lucknow, not just in Lucknow, but throughout this eastern belt, because we, we stopped at various places and spoke to people, the local ones, uh, they all say that they are very, very scared uh, with what has happened this afternoon. Uh, because okay. this, uh, let me tell you, this area lies in a very low seismic activity zone area, yes. uh, uh, which is almost uh, on the fourth level uh, as compared to uh, uh, the, uh, the areas uh, in the upper reaches of Himalayas, also uh, uh, North India. So these are the people who never witnessed uh, such uh, huge uh, tremors the way they were seen uh, this afternoon. So it will take some time before these people settle down and understand the real, uh, uh, you know, the, the outcome of this devastating earthquake in Nepal.